hi guys and welcome back to stardew valley day five part five of the let's play on youtube i am live streaming the game over on twitch if you guys would like to follow over there it's miss lisa juliet that's m-a-s-l-i-s-a-j-u-l-i-e-t-t-e -T -T -E on twitch if you guys want to hang out there and you know follow along be involved in in the game um i'll also obviously be checking the comments on youtube and I'm taking that into account. So let's see our mail. Hello Lisa, my name is Susan. Lewis told me you're a new farmer in town. I'm trapped on my farm in the mountains, so I can't say hi to hi in person. Hopefully the mess Jojo made will be cleared out soon because I'm going a little stir crazy. Can't wait to meet you and see how the farm is shaping up. Susan. All right, uh, more mail. To our valued Jojo Mart customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal <laughs> pursuant to INIT L61091 Georgia Co. Amendment. Responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we valued you, value your continued support and patronage, Morris. Morris. Joja customer satisfaction representative and even more dear farmer lisa you might need more space someday that's where i can help if you bring me some raw materials and pay a fee i can expand your house the first expansion i offer includes a kitchen with a kitchen you'll be able to cook any recipes you've learned anyway i hope you're starting to feel at home in stardew valley your local carpenter robin ah, i think it's going to be a while till we can afford that house upgrade but it looks like our first crops are ready. Great news. Okay, let's start harvesting. <laughs> looks like the majority of our day is going to be a farming day. Because we've got to get new crops in the ground. Oh, got our first gold parsnip. Leveled up. Right, I'm going to hang on to the gold ones for now because I believe we need five is that correct let me check yeah five gold parsnips all right okay that is yep yeah, that's everything for today let me go put this parsnip away before i accidentally sell it because that would would suck we really want to get this done in um spring one when i get as much community center stuff done as possible but these can be sold great okay so 7 40 a.m i'm not too sure what time the store opens i think it might be nine it could be eight it's a friday let's start making our way over there so we can get these seeds in the ground get them watered and then um oh traveling merchant is in town that's ex oh we could get strawberry seeds today possibly oh let's go look for her first if we can get those strawberry seeds, those are super profitable. I think we need about 15 days for those, but those are our most profitable crop. So let's see that first. Let's try to find her. Oh, picking up another wild seed. Got a little bit of weed there that we've got. Ah, let's clear the path. Um, she should be near where, like on the way to the wizard, but of course in um, this expanded map might be a little trickier to find her so let's see how we can make our way wrong direction maybe yeah this is why we need some time okay there has to be a way through here um here is another path is this just gonna sort of like take us down to the waterfall ah no it looks like we can get through okay uh this way might as well grab these one gold per weed all right that is not the way to the wizard Yeah, we're getting quite turned around here. Okay, let's try something a little different. That all, that piece of ore can can wait for us. There is no rush for that. Really want to find the traveling merchant today. 
but I'm gonna go the long way around just to try and guarantee we can find her. What if I look on the map? Who do we have? We have the wizard over here. The traveling merchant marked on here. It's jazz. I assume the the merchant. I feel like that's the merchant over there. Okay. Well, we are going the long way around. We will figure this out. Once we find her, we'll try find her. Figure out what exactly the route is. Oh, community center time. Great. Maybe clicking on it yesterday did help us. Oh, hi there. What an eyesore. This is the Pelican Town Community Center, or what's left of it anyway. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now, just look at it, it's shameful. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV and then engage with the community. But listen to me, I sound like an old fool. Jojo Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. Guess old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Ah well. If anyone else buys a Jojo Co membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. Sigh. Here, let's go inside. What's this? I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. A Junimo! <laughs> Look at him waving. What? What's the matter? Are you ill? You saw something, hmm? I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. <laughs> it's a strange looking rat. <laughs> You're worrying me, Lisa. Look, I think I'm going to head home. I need some lunch. <laughs> Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on, and maybe you can help me catch that rat if you have some extra time. Strange. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Alright, well, let's deal with the community centre another day, perhaps tomorrow could also I think already complete our spring foraging bundle uh, but we really want to try and find this traveling merchant ah, another cutscene this time with Andy uh, it's the new farmer how are you doing on this fine sunny day you caught me in the middle of tending to my crops and spreading some new Joja fertilizer on my crop field. I always use the Joja fertilizer. It makes my crops stronger and healthier. Say, you're just starting out on Callista Farm. I have something for, something for you to help you out. I have some strawberry seeds for you. Fairhaven Farm strawberries have a good reputation in Grampleton and Chestervale. Ooh, strawberry seeds. You receive the strawberry seeds tomorrow in the mail. We've got to get back to the farm work. You have yourself a nice day, Lisa. Go get some dirt on ya. Thanks, Andy. Well, that's pretty cool. We're on our way to find the traveling merchant for strawberry seeds already. So now we've got some. We'll be expecting some in the mail tomorrow. Um, but let's see still if we can find her. Might have to orientate ourselves with the map quickly. Right, so we're down here. Surely can't be. Ah, there we go. Right, we found her. What do we have? Acorn, cactus fruit, 
Coconut milk, slime, bug meat, puffer fish, tulip, iron bar, summer, spangle, wild horseradish, festival dining table, rare seed. No. Well, no strawberry seeds, but a good thing that we checked. No idea what the rare seed is. So in fall, takes all season to grow. Hmm. Could try to get that. Buy fall, half price 3000 Could be worth it. Um, yeah too bad for us but we will be getting strawberry seeds in the mail um maybe i should try knocking on the wizard's door to sort of start that um you know dialogue i'm not sure what triggers it i don't know if it's a particular day it's locked you can hear someone inside though all right i'm trying to think could even be day five or something like that that triggers it so it might be a coincidence if it um, happens in the next few days but just in case we have knocked on the door okay so let's see so straight up ah okay we come out right there I keep missing this little entrance way here but right I think this takes us straight onto our farm yeah all right now we know we've been reminded we know how to get back very quick from the farm actually took a very bad wrong turn but let's see um seeds we need to be planting seeds today uh you need to make a beeline for uh, the general store let's put some stuff away make some more space sell these make a run for it um, I'm sure the store only closes at about five so we should be good one would be a bit early for it to close so let's see let's see what we can get seeds for sale exactly what I wanted all right so how can I? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten parsnips. Maybe another five. I think we had fifteen last time. Uh, potatoes, super profitable. Six days to mature. What was parsnips? Four days. Let's one, two, three, four, five. Five more potatoes. I don't have any kale. Six days to mature harvest with the scythe. Um, bean starter. You know, we haven't planted kale. I'll get one kale in case. I'm not sure we need it for anything, but just in case, let's do one kale. Um, and then let's get two cauliflower, and then we have all the seeds we can buy. Let's say hi to Abigail while we're here. Wow, I just realized it's Friday. And then this is the doctor, I believe, Harvey. Yeah. This stuff can definitely be incorporated into a healthy diet. All right. Have a good one, Lisa. Glad to see you back. Thanks, Neon Afflictions. Good to see you again, too. Hope to see you in the next one. And thanks for coming back. I really appreciate you. Love that emote too, by the way. That emote is adorable. All right. Let's plant our parsnips. Okay, potatoes. There's no real order. But that's all right. We don't have that much going on right now. We can be more structured with what we plant where at another time. Okay, here we go. This should be everything. Yeah. All right. Let's empty out this watering can. 
Fill it up again. Gonna wanna upgrade this watering can pretty soon. It's a lot of single clicking. <laughs> We still have time we can today so we can still try to go and get some more copper ore not too sure how many bars we need to upgrade the the watering can but definitely all in one i think it might be three to five it's usually around what it is in these farm sims but we can make about five and then go and check worst case scenario we have extra and we're just that much closer to upgrading our second tool. And looks like we had just enough water. Okay. Well, oh, great. Our new crops are in the ground. That is taken care of. Let's go. See if we can find some ore. Uh, come back for that node later but first let's go right here aha look at that it did respawn already okay let's get our important ones and then might be able to make a run to the mines uh let's take out the wood here there's another doorway over there i'm not too sure what is in there Gonna want to upgrade this pickaxe too. Quite a lot of hits and so many geodes. We're really gonna want to break these up. Um, could get some really good stuff from those. Let's get these copper veins. I think that's all our. Yep, looks like that's all the copper veins that we have for now. What is in here? Oh, another mine car? Nope, looks like a dead end. Oh well. Okay, let us see. Where does this. Where are we on the map? Sophia and Marlin, for some reason they're up in that corner. I'm not sure if that means in the desert or if that's just a little bit of a glitch. Uh, I don't. You know, I don't see us on the map. Maybe we're... This is kind of like an undisclosed location. Um, but yeah, it is getting... It's getting a little late. We didn't get any coal from that. So I think we're going to have to put some wood in the furnace to make some more coal. Let's get that. We have a piece of wood on us. Requires one coal. How do we how do we make coal then? Okay, well, seven thirty. We do not have um, a glow ring yet, so I don't know how long we are going to last. <laughs> but let's uh, quickly run over there, see if we can get a couple pieces of coal. Hmm. If you need coal to burn wood, hmm. Ooh. And a salmon berry. Very cool. Ah, here's Marlin. Marlin. Hmm. I was just wondering how far down this mine shaft goes. I'm going to take care of some of the monsters in here before they start climbing out into the valley. I've met a lot of adventurers in my time. I recognize that look in your eye. Old age hasn't robbed me of my eyesight or my skill with the sword quite yet. 
Take this weapon. It may not look like much, but it's imbued with magic. With it, you'll be able to battle the monsters here. You received a rusty sword. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself and I might think about making you a member. Alright, in progress with the mines. Isn't that exciting? Alright, so let's let's see. It doesn't seem to be working. Okay. So do we go down here? Yeah, here we are. Okay. Interesting. We've got like this is green thing. Oh I yeah, I have a mod to show where the ladders are. Kind of a little bit cheaty. Uh, a little bit cheaty, yeah. <laughs> but we're we're gonna roll with it. Ooh, what are you? We're not gonna be able to go very far today because um, our inventory is very full. Ah, monsters in here too. We should probably we should fight one. That might be what gets us. Through. Ooh, I need to select the sword. Oh, I forgot how to attack. <laughs> Shoot. Okay. Oh my goodness. That that, that that took a second. Um We're gonna have to leave those goodies here. We don't we don't have the space. We don't want to drop anything else. Um salmon berry. Could need the salmon berry for something. I'm not too sure. Uh alright. Oh, 11, 11 pm. Right leave the mine but that was a pretty constructive day if I do so so myself made progress in the mines maybe tomorrow we could do some more mining I forgot to check the weather but um, rainy days are a pretty good day for mining we don't have the most expansive farm yet so you know watering doesn't take up too much time or too much energy we probably still could get about um, five levels down uh, in the mine I believe that I believe the elevators are every five levels, maybe every ten. But we should be able to to do that, especially with our handy dandy ladder mod. Um I wonder. Topaz is eighty gold. Oh okay, we need to take this to Gunther. Okay. So there'll be no selling of that. Um let's put some stuff in storage mm. take that on another day put this in here our geodes everything we need a watering can in the morning don't want to forget that all right yep Ooh, and it's starting to get late so we're gonna be heading off to bed level up level one farming watering can proficiency plus one hoe proficiency plus one new crafting recipe scarecrow new crafting recipe basic fertilizer i think we're gonna we're gonna want to get one of those scarecrows definitely don't want to lose crops to um crows that that sucks when that happens uh let's see what did we get ah oh, got some money rolling in from our first harvest 638 gold from those parsnips it's pretty good 28 gold from those weeds for a total of 666 gold hmm. okay <laughs> the devil's number <laughs> um yeah so this is where i'll be leaving off for the youtube let's play um and then i will see you guys for part six on day six